One grab, you, you, you get so much percent coming out, and Waldo's just going to rack it up. He's going to continue to just pack on the pounds, and uh, if, if Cashmere drops one one follow-up, yeah. then just as quickly, that back air is just going to completely <laughs> We're going to see how careful he is, too, near the ledge. Because if he does do normal get-ups and we see a reaction grab coming out from Waldo, because of his weight, Waldo can easily get up throw to forward air. And that will true confirm into stocks. Uh, one of the situations in which it's not a 50 50. But right off the bat, Cashman looking good. We are here. Loser sent me his Ooh. fuck. Talk to In the him. blink of an eye, just closing the distance. Get that dash grab. Even though being pushed out by Waldo. <laughs> Cashmere is so relentless in his onslaught, and that's that's really just part of his game plan. Like, just instill fear in the opponent, make him know, all right, at any moment I can drop another hitbox on you. So please start air dodging, do whatever you think you can do to escape, <laughs> and I have something ready for you. That F smash, very oh, nearly no. missing oh, the mark. Oh, he almost got the. I, I'm actually not sure if that would spike, but regardless, these guys are. They're working on their combo reel. I want to be straight on with you. Oh These my guys goodness, are insane! Again. The big reads! He is trying to read every air dodge Waldo goes for right now. Okay, yep. Just a little right, bit of misspacing still... there. Overextension coming up from Kashmir. Getting punished, losing the neutral advantage, but ooh, I'm not so sure about that side beat. <laughs> this is looking like full court basketball. Like Waldo has the right side of the stage yeah, held yeah, down. Yeah. Kashmir getting knocked to the left. Oh, okay. Well, like full board, sorry, full court basketball, I want to see if these guys start to get tired mid-game. Are they going to tone it down? Are they going to slow it down? Just look for the good shots? Or are they going to just keep going in, man? What's man. the pressure points look like here? These guys, are, <laughs> <laughs> I want to see what they want to do. Oh, and the slow approach in there. That's something that kind of like... Um, wakes people up is that Ike really does have that active hookbox on the Nair, regardless of which side he's really on. But whoa, Raptor boost. Full extension. That was a half court shot right there. <laughs> We're just going to keep, keep it going with the analogy. I, <laughs> I do like, though, uh, Mr. Stefan Curry over here. <laughs> uh, just kind of like waiting in space and then just giving, <laughs> giving Kashmir the sauce. I'm telling you, dude. Yeah, just missing that Nair, oh my goodness. You really can't give Waldo too many opportunities. At 110, time is starting to run, oh my goodness. All right, went past the ledge. That's a trademark Cashmere move. Does he hit the Raptor dive right in front of him? Or the oh, Falcon dive? I'm actually surprised there. I feel like he could pull the trigger from the back there, but regardless, he did keep the advantage. Yeah, but tried. now Cashmere, this is big. Cashmere gets one, two, okay. four. If he gets one more up here, here. Great pivot grab, and he's still racking up this damage. He's getting yeah, the 90%. He didn't go for the knee there. I'm glad he didn't because I don't think he could have gotten it. But regardless, this is right back to neck and neck, man. And that's that third quarter play. Uh-huh. He's trying to get these weather readers, man. <laughs> that's why they slowed it down. Don't call a foul, though, coach. <laughs> <laughs> I can still play. Gets the grips. F throw. Going to send him farther out this time. Oh! oh! That's a buzzer beater right there. That sure is. All or nothing, baby. That's when you're like getting fouled and you just throw it up and it still goes in. You get the <laughs> yeah. hand one Let's play. Let's go for that nothing. five point play. Where's <laughs> <laughs> that slice out of it, Scott? You like just throw it over your body. <laughs> Sorry, that's that's four point play. Sorry, regardless. <laughs> Man, what's going so strong? I mean, it could be five. There's a technical in there too. Oh yeah, yeah, <laughs> true, true, true. You're playing against green, man. <laughs> Ah, and he tried to open the game with what ended the first. Walter tried to side be in. Cashmere. <laughs> yeah, just yeah, right zero percent. <laughs> yeah, exactly right. <laughs> why not? Nothing. Yeah, why not? Let's, let's Everything, go. Yo, anything is possible. Kevin Garnett. Right? <laughs> <laughs> We're still on Smash Bros. We're still doing basketball analogies. What's happening? CFL SmackDown. <laughs> Ooh, up throw. Actually, reading like hard di in there. He went for the back back air. Uh, Walter not able to get it, but that would have given him so. Such great advantage, and I do like it. Throwing the little mix-ups early, that could lead to something big. That's a real top player thing to do, because even though you're not going to get the best advantage from it, if you're not put in a bad situation, go for something big like that. Yeah. Wait for them to make that huge mistake so that you can capitalize, get the big early lead that you need. And I like how Kashmir is just um, doing double jumps and then just staying towards like a quarter in on the stage. Seeing that Waldo's been doing the uh, the high releases of his side beat, um, 
knows that he really can find some kind of opportunity if he slides right by. And I like how you pointed that out. That is something that Waldo will do quite a bit, those high releases. You know, it's the same with Rio. It's just oh. kind of like understanding that there's not a ton of landing lag. It's kind of like uh, Fox, but regardless, if you're able to find that shield... Yeah, Kazmir now awake. He, he knows that he's not going to... Oh, oh, my goodness! Wow, what a Went over man. the top, dodges his sword, because that can hit you and knock you out of the move. So that could have set up for something awful, but instead... Kashmir finding his result, the wanted one. Yes, and going so high there with the hug <laughs> again. And that's a little bit of the read that you get on somebody, right? Yeah, I'm, you... I'm a little unsure if, uh, if Walden will go for another dash attack. It looked like it. <laughs> he might have wanted it. He's not getting the jank, but that ether. Yeah. Could have waited. You gotta, you gotta build up that air acceleration again. Get towards the stage before you release it, because that was way too high. He could have, he could have hung on a little bit longer. Might, might be a little bit of panic because, of course, you are in the late stages of the tournament that's going for fifth, but... Uh. Yeah. <laughs> Funk, I mean, Funk, we were talking about earlier how Tampa's strength is definitely punish game. Another thing is just adaptation, man. It, it's the land of Manny. Uh, it's the land of just, you know, Red Halbert <laughs> or, like, like, some of these old school guys, but there's just so much adaptation that's been kind of brought down by these guys that get these huge punishes. And that's a big part of punishes, right? That yeah. early adaptation to find the punish that you need. So if Kashmir just keeps this, keep this momentum going, kind of like the momentum he had with Kiki. Ooh. So I'm not, I, I actually somewhat disagree, I guess, with the uh, the fact that we adapt. I think that we have like calculated nuttiness, right? <laughs> like Kashmir and Rydia, <laughs> those guys play based off of passion, what they feel is going well. And if it's not working, they will completely discard their past strategy and try a different approach. It's not really adaptation, but they, they know that, okay, if I can go for something really crazy, it'll disarm them, and I can go right back to my game plan. All right, hear me out real quick. Yep. You're talking about passion. It, it kind of makes me think of not only reaction, but just kind of like when you say play from your heart, it also makes me think of play from instinct. Yeah. A, a big part of human instinct or animal instinct, you could say, is adaptation. It is those slight little things that you feel out the change, not necessarily thinking about it, but adaptation and reaction based off of just calculations that you've learned in your past. And like now, because of that, you're just adapting naturally. Mm -hmm. Oh, man. So smart recovery there from Kashmir allowed him to stay into the stock, dash away and find a Raptor boost for a kill. So big exchange and a huge conversion. So. Uh, Kashmir trying to find his one. Oh, yes. oh no, the ant. Yes. The, is that the real? <laughs> but you saw how he <laughs> ducked too. He ducked just as in case you dive high. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna punish you, baby. Alright, Jack Conwell just sending him off stage. And Another up. Oh, do you see but, that fade back though, just to avoid the grab? Great stuff for Kashmir. Yeah, just toying with the movement. Jab, jab, down throw, near. Ooh, but All right. stay on yeah. that platform, baby. Waldo's out here to play. 3, 2, 1. You done? I don't know, man. Ooh, 77% now on Kashmir. Yeah, Waldo was menacing a down air attempt. Excuse me. Now, this is good because earlier on, we saw Kashmir obviously had just the tempo. He had oh. everything. But regardless, Waldo's starting to get that. He's still oh, trying wow. to get those dash through grabs. Holy oh, crap. Wow. How did <laughs> Waldo find that and move? And he's in his head, too, to find these air dodges that he needs. All right, Jab looking right, for the grab. grab. That's a mix-up. Oof. Oof, he's got that falling up here, man. That might have been current. Try to get him with the steel toes. All right, we're in the range for Waldo to look. Oh, what was that? Was that an up tilt? No, it was up tilt. No, no, up tilt, okay. Up tilt, yeah. He, uh, Tomahawk, yeah, yeah. Like, yeah, okay. uh, yeah, I was saying. Uh, Tomahawk 